Hello and welcome to T100 My Digital Life. This is a quick video guide to finding your way around the T100 website. We're going to take a look at the links to many useful items that will help you in your studies. Down the centre of the page is the planner. Click here to see the entire planner. Or you can view just the next five weeks by clicking here. The planner shows you what you need to do and when you need to do it. You can see what each block contains and the dates you should be studying the contents of each block. Clicking this link takes you to a page that contains all the resources that are used in more than one part of T100. You'll be referred to these resources from the relevant texts. The planner shows you exactly when tutor marked and computer marked assignments are due. These are also listed here, along with guides to completing assignments successfully. You can also see your tutorial dates. Remember this is a demonstration view. The dates, times and venues will be relevant to you when you log on to the site. Down the left hand side of the home page you'll find a summary of your assessments. You're looking at the home page of a fictitious OU student but you'll see a version of this which is unique to you with your own results as you complete the assignments. You'll also see quick links to your tutor's contact details and links to other vital information. There'll be more on completing and submitting assignments in an upcoming video, so keep visiting the forum to check for this. If you're not sure how to use the planner or what some of the terms mean, then click on the question mark icons for a quick explanation. On the right hand side, you'll see more links you can access. This link will take you to OU Live. You'll use this link to join the rest of your tutor group and sometimes other students and tutors from Region 5 for online tutorials. The next important link I'd like to point out on the right hand side is the one to study resources. You'll see a link to the TU100 guide and supporting items. Here you'll find useful resources such as materials to help improve your math skills. And links to the sense files including the installation guide. And the online version of the programming guide. The activities you complete throughout the course using the Sense programming environment and the Sense board are all linked from here for convenience. But you'll also find links at appropriate points in the module materials. The OU has an extensive library which is available to you along with support from our librarians. Using the library effectively is an important academic skill which you'll study. Efficient use of the library will allow you to find materials to support your studies. And during the course we'll look at how we can formally acknowledge the work of others through referencing. This link is a shortcut route to finding answers to many of the questions Level 1 students have when they first start studying with the OU. You'll be able to address any weak areas in your skill set here. There are a range of startup activities available on the website and it's very handy to be able to work through these. They're designed to help identify any areas you need to focus on early in the course. If you have any concerns about these, please contact your own tutor or ask in our regional group forum. 
The regional group form can be reached by following this link and it's only open to Region 5 students and tutors. By raising queries there you'll get the most effective response from your own tutor, one of the other tutors or a fellow student. We all have our strengths and you may find that you know the answers to other students' queries too. Tutors will add and update information about the module throughout the presentation with timely links relevant to the topics as you reach them in your studies. Tutors will also post links to your individual tutor group forums which you'll be using for some of the activities which are specific to individual tutor groups. And here's a final handy tip. You can subscribe to any forum by clicking this button at the bottom. Then at any time someone posts to the forum, you'll be notified by email and so you can keep right up to date with everything that's going on and not risk missing out on postings of vital information from the regional tutors. I'll leave you with a summary of the things you need to be completing now. We'll be adding more video tutorials at key points in the course, so keep a lookout in the forum for these links. Let us know what you think about this video by posting in the regional forum. Bye for now, and thanks for watching.